Welcome to my live. I am so excited that you're able to join me. We are going to have so much fun. Say hi as you come in so I know that you're here. If you are new and are not currently working with a designer, please just comment the word newbie and I will make sure to send you some Chocotour information. If you're watching the replay, hi. So what is Chocotour? We are a fun high-end DIY home decor company used to make different gifts and decorations from your home on a budget. So Chocotour has so many fun products. We have our Chocology Chalk Paste, which is great for chalkboards where you can design and repeat as much as you like. We also have Couture Ink, so you can make permanent on fabrics or glass or ceramics. We have hundreds of reusable silkscreen transfers, lots of fun tools, and a full assortment of different surfaces for all of your projects. You want to make sure you join my Chocoholic VIP group. This is where there's so much more fun and there's specials. You can also sign up for a workshop. I love to hold workshops and share my love of Chalk Couture. We also have Club Couture. This is a fun mail subscription where you get an exclusive transfer and chalk paste sent to your home every month for the low price of $19.99. You can also host your own private party, get your friends and family together and make your own projects. You can also become a designer and start your own empire. There's so many different ways with Chalk Couture to make money. If you are excited about any of these things, please just send me a message message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. So don't forget, in my Chocoholic VIP group, if you post a picture of your finished project, you'll be entered in a drawing for a free transfer every month. How exciting is that? So without further ado, let's go on and let's chalk this project. Thank you so much for helping me and let's chalk. Hello, hello everybody. Good morning. It is Sunday. Hi Vanessa. Hello, hello. I wanted to come on here and talk about the Grinch workshop. I am so excited about this workshop. This is going to be so much fun. Um, and the fun thing about this workshop is that there's not just one way to do it. That kind of goes along with Chalk Couture, that your creativity, um, everything is pretty much endless. So I showed you guys, wait, let me get it. I showed you guys the photo, didn't I? Here, let me pull it up. Here is the photo that I used to show the workshop. Um, this one is using a um, 12 by 18 Sylvie. It's using the Santa I Can't Explain and then the little ornament. Um, super cute. I love that you could personalize that ornament. Now that ornament is wood. Um, I'm gonna show you a few different options today, okay? Um, this is going to be so much fun. So let me go ahead and just share my workstation. Hi, Diane. So when you get your bag, um, this is our little Grinch package. There's some surprises in here, but I'm going to show you some of the, um, things that the workshop comes with. Okay. When you get your baggie, um, you are going to find, let's see here. You're going to find some of our paste trays, our color trays in here. That's going to be to hold your paste. You're going to have um, some paste singles. I'm kind of on the fence. I may end up actually using um, my little jars because I feel like they're a little easier to work with. So you may actually get jars of your colors. We'll see. We'll see what colors people get. Um, you can actually select three colors for your project. Um, and then to help you with stirring, you're going to get three. Is there a third one in here? You're going to get three um, of the stir sticks. Yeah. Yep. Um, and then, let's see. What do we have here? You can choose um, between the ornament, which is wood. Um, you have... A chalk chip that you can choose to get either in the white or the black they are double-sided all of them okay and then if you get the ornament you also get a little um, a little what do you call that twine and then you will get some assorted ribbon I have so many different kinds of ribbons and then let's see um diane i will mail out the kits once i hear because some depending on what surface you're going to use might depend on the size of the grinch and we'll go over that um then in here 
you'll have your Grinch hand, okay? You'll have your Grinch sleeve. You will have some fur and then you will have a squeegee, okay? So all of this is gonna come in your Grinch kit. Let's go ahead and put these in here. So then you're thinking, well, I just threw that star stick. Well, okay, the, everything comes in the kit. Now, what am I gonna put this on? So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to my chalk site and take a look, or you may already have a surface you wanna use. Let me go ahead and type this in here chalkcouture.com Michelle Postal. Okay. So that is my chalk site. So you can look at different surfaces. Um, we do have a lot of different surfaces. You could use, um, oh, I don't have it to where I can share my screen. Um, you could use um, a door tag. You could use um, a canvas that you get from the local craft store. You could use our Grayson, you can use our Sylvie. If you wanted your arm to be magnetic, you can use your Aiden. Um, if you're using an Aiden, I will include magnets um, that are adhesive that you can put on the back of your felt so that when you put it on your board, you can take it back off and still use your Aiden for another project, okay? Um, you could use the nine by 12, or you can use, like this is a, a larger um, Grayson, you can use a 12 by 18. Um, depending on what transfer you are going to use, um, that can change the size of your board. So if you wanted to use, I'll show you the transfer that is in the picture. Um, this is one of my favorite transfers. It's the Santa I Can Explain. It also has the Son of a Nutcracker on there. So this is a C size transfer, but look at all the pieces you get. You get the Santa I Can Explain, which I think goes perfect with the Grinch. Um, and the Son of a Nutcracker is one of my favorites. Um, we also have the Nutcracker transfer, so that goes really nicely with our Nutcracker transfer. This also comes with the cute ribbon you can use to chalk if you don't wanna use um, the ribbon I send, and then you also have a little bell. So all of this is multi-use. Remember our transfers are reusable. One of the other transfers that I love is the Merry Christmas to all and to all a good night. So you can just use the Merry Christmas part, but I love this. You could use any part of that um, to make your board. Today we're gonna do something a little different. And the surface that I have chosen is our Odette board, okay? Let me move all this stuff. This is the Odette and I have picked the nine by 12. Let me make sure it goes the right way. Um, I love the surface because you're gonna do, hi May. Yes, you can purchase, you wanna purchase the kit? So in the Chocoholic VIP group, there is an event there. Just go to the VIP group. If you're not a VIP, comment VIP, um, and I can give you the link in there. Um, but when you go in the VIP group, go under events and it'll say Grinch Workshop. This is going to be a live class. I'm gonna create with you at the same time and help you along. Um, it's gonna be um, kind of like a Zoom, but you don't have to have the app. It's gonna be right here in Facebook in a room. So instead of Zoom, it's room. And um, we're all gonna be able to see each other. We're all gonna be able to talk to each other. So it's gonna be a super fun way um, to do something a little sh social during this whole craziness, okay? So it's gonna be super fun. I'm just cleaning off my board here. Um, this is the board that I chose to do because it is super cute. I like that um, it has the white background so I can put any color I want on it and it will really pop. Um, and I like how the price is on point. Now this comes in a um, 12 by 18 as well. This is the smaller one. This is the nine by 12. I just want a little board. Um, I mean, this isn't really little, but I'm going to put this particular one on, um, on here. And, uh, oh gosh, I wish I had a picture of the transfer. That's what I forgot to put on here is a picture of the transfer that's not cut up. Um, 
But what we're going to do is something a little different than the first picture. We have a transfer called Christmas Countdown. It has all the numbers um, and it has days until Christmas. It has Santa stops here. Oh dear. I really should have pulled up a picture and I did not. Hold on. Um, I'm pretty sure that it is a C size transfer. It comes with an ornament. Um, so you could even, if you have a larger board, you could even have the Grinch holding this. Do you see what I mean? Depending on how big your board is. I love this transfer. Um, this was one of my favorite transfers last year and it came back this year. It comes with all the numbers. And you even have the words Merry. So if you just wanted to say Merry Christmas on your board, you can do that as well. But what I wanna do is I want the Grinch to do a countdown, okay? So um, let's use that and that. And I also wanted to show you, if you are planning to use a chalk chip um, and not a countdown, we do have several, <clears throat> We do have several um, cute little options that you can do as well. For example, we have the Holiday Advice Trio. Um, so you could, a lot of these fit on here. How cute is this? If you were to have the Grinch and it said Better Not Pout, you could fit this on the Chalkable Chip Better Not Pout. You could put the Better Not Pout on an ornament and you could have the Grinch holding an ornament that says Better Not Pout. Uh, Michelle, I want to, okay, let me know, May. Um, so I have two of these. Um, these are perfect for our mini tags, but they're also perfect for decorating any other project. So this would be perfect for this as well. Um, and I just think the Better Not Pout with the Grinch is adorable. <laughs> Remember, these are all reusable. If you are using a um, wooden ornament, if that's what you choose in your kit, just remember it's one-time use. Um, so if you glue this down and you put something on this ornament, you can't erase it and put something else. But the chalkable chips, you can. You can just wipe them off and then redesign, all right? So let's go ahead and build our Grinch countdown using the days until Christmas transfer and the kit that you'll get in the mail. Let's see, like this and like this. And first I'm going to just, good morning, good morning. place my pieces so I can see where everything's gonna go. So I know that I want this Grinch arm like this, okay? Another fun thing would be if you were to make a gift for somebody else and you were to use the ornament, you could even use our fonts to put their last um, name initial on there. You can write a message um, using our chalk markers. So you can personalize this any way you want to. There's so much you can do. Um, but for now, we are going to and then we have our fur there. I'm just trying to get a feel. So I'm gonna do a Christmas Grinch countdown. So I'm gonna have my days until Christmas. Um, and I'm gonna choose the chocolate chip because I wanna do a countdown. I wanna be able to change it every day and see how many days it is until Christmas because it'll be here before you know it. So you can um, choose if you want a uh, black chalk chip or if you want white. Um, I'm a little on the fence right now. I don't, I don't wanna use wood because I wanna change it. Um, and then I'm going to, hmm. What do you guys think? Should I do white? White is cute, but black is cute too. We can do either or. It's gonna look like an ornament that he's holding up. But right now, I'm just gonna go like that. And then what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna just take, Diane, the fur is actual faux fur. So I got a long piece of it. So you may get some shedding when it comes to you depending on how, how it goes, but it's gonna look like that, okay? Um, and then, like I said, if you're using an Aiden or a magnetic board, let me know and I will include some adhesive magnets to it. You like the black, Diane? Okay, we'll do the black. 
So I'm just gonna take my hot glue gun and I'm gonna start by putting the hand on. All right, I'm just gonna put a little bit of hot glue on this guy. And I'm gonna figure out where I want his hand to go. I kind of want it near the center like this. So I'm just gluing it down. I didn't glue down all the fingers. Hi, Christy. Let me get my cord untangled. So, and you don't have to, it's probably not gonna move. I have good news though. I did finally get the um, little finger protectors, but you can see how I am so bold and just so adventurous. I'm not even using them. I got them from Amazon in two days, but still continue to burn my fingers because I'm not using it. <laughs> All right, so I'm just gluing this onto my Odette. Okay, just like that. Ooh, Sammy wants to come and see the Grinch like that. And like I said, you will have some surprises in your bag. And if you are a Club Couture member of mine, you may find even more surprises in your bag. Oh, my fingers, my poor fingers, ouch. All right, so then I'm gonna put, now the only thing that's really gonna change um, when you pick your surface is if you pick an extra large surface, I may send you a longer sleeve so that he's reaching further, okay? I think the hand is gonna stay the same size. Um, so make sure you let me know what colors you want, um, what chip you want, um, and then um, what size board you're using. And then I'm gonna take my fur and also I'm just gonna, I just ordered a battery operated glue gun off Amazon this morning. So we'll see how I like that. I'm just gonna take this here. The fun using a glue gun is burning. <laughs> that is part of the fun, right, Christy? I guess my body, um, and then you can just kind of fan this out, okay? I, I was kind of torn between just using regular white felt or fur, but don't you think that the fur is so much more fun? I think it is. I think it gives it that extra dimension. I just love fur. Um, yes, just message me that info or you could post it in the event, whatever you like to do, whatever you like to do. Okay, there we go. So then, now we have our little Grinch arm. What do you think? I'm gonna go ahead and take my chalk chip and I am just, you could either Velcro these things if you feel like you're gonna change it. I already know that I'm gonna love this so much that I never want it to go off. And these would also make amazing gifts, wouldn't it? Would it not? Okay, the fur does make it. Yes, I love the fur. And I will tell you guys, I didn't, I didn't, is it skins, skins on the fur? I didn't go cheap on the fur. They sell um, little faux fur in like little packs. Um, and I looked at it, I felt it. Um, I went through three different stores looking at felt. I didn't even trust Amazon to give me the felt I feel like you deserve. So I went to Joann's, I went to the big felt on the, um, big things, what do you call those? The bolts or whatever. I felt every single one. Um, and I chose the fur that I thought I love the most. And um, I can't even tell you whether or not I really calculated into the workshop. I don't even know because uh, I knew what I wanted to price point the workshop at and I knew what I wanted to do. And um, I mean, I was not willing to go. Um, <laughs> I came in late. Can you talk about how the class will work a little bit, please? Um, yeah, I will go back over it at the, at the end, Christy, or you can watch the replay. Um, but we'll finish this project, and then I'll tell you exactly. Um, I'll go over the, the kit that comes with the workshop again. All right, so now we have that. Let's go ahead and chalk. So we have our days until Christmas. Um, the colors that I wanted to use, of course, I still have out on loan. Um, I haven't received my colors back, but that's okay. We still have different colors. Um, I'm trying to think if Spring Zing is even on the website. I'd have to look. 
Um, I've never even seen the fur, but I've never really looked for it. Uh, yeah, some of the craft stores have it where they have like the pom-poms and stuff like that, but it is very generic. It's not fluffy. This is super fluffy, but I am going to warn you, you may have, that's why I'm putting your fur in these little mesh bags because you may have some shedding from where I cut. Okay. But look how fluffy this is. I just want to make like a hat out of it. Okay. So let's use spring zing. I think spring zing really matches the Grinch hand very, very good. I think citrus splash might, but if you like the spring zing and you don't want a full jar, pick it as one of your colors and I can put it in the little jar for you. Okay. So I'm going to use these two colors. I'm going to use this is scarlet. This is one of our um, new and vogue colors. I haven't chalked all week since I've been at work. So I'm going to add just a little bit of distilled water in here. Um, so I'm going to stir in some distilled water to make it the right consistency. And if you get the little jar of paste, um, you may need to add a little bit of uh, water. It doesn't have to be distilled because by the time you use up your little jar, it won't have time really to grow any mold. So that's okay. And then the spring zing, which I think is a perfect Grinch color, right? This is um, one of our spring in Vogue colors. I, I don't know if it's still available online or if you would even want a full size jar. So if you choose this color, I will fill one of these little jars for you to get the spring zing. But I think that's just the perfect, perfect color. Um, and then we're going to go this is cute too though. Santa stops here. Should we do Santa stops here or Christmas? I think I want to do Santa stops here. I love Santa Claus and I don't know how much longer I'm going to have a believer. Okay. We'll do until Santa stops here, but you do have the option of doing Christmas also. Okay. So remember this transfer within itself has a lot of different options. I'm going to check the fuzz factor. Okay. Um, and this one, like I said, is this transfers over a year old. I don't feel like I need to fuzz it. I'm going to just put it down here. I think that'll be plenty of room. Perfect. Okay. Um, I think that looks good. Yeah. You know, I'm not good at centering stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and just put the word Santa in the scarlet and then I'm gonna do the rest um, in in that. Right, Christy? So I'm taking my, my mini squeegee, which will also be in your kit, and I am just going to go like this and get all the excess off. Santa. I really thought I would do this in my Shimmer Crimson, which I do have singles of, um, and I should have all my paste returned to me before I mail out the workshop. Either that I'm going to hunt this girl down and take it back. <laughs> so that you guys can have shimmer colors if you want shimmer colors. And then we'll do stops here in the spring zing, which look at this. Isn't this the perfect Grinch green? So definitely remember spring zing. Just say, I want some of that spring zing and you can have it. I think I'm gonna use the spring zing more for Christmas than I did in spring. Yeah, maybe they should just, oh no. I got some red in my R. Oh. I got some red on my squeegee, but that's okay. If it looks horrible, oh, now I just really drug red. Hold on, let's just peel it. I'm gonna have to wash it and do it. I didn't realize that I was, I even have my glasses on. So we're gonna peel this off. Dun, 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 dun. Santa stops here. And you see, I got some green down there. Um, I'm gonna wipe off. I'm gonna tear my, did you guys know you can tear your board erasers? I'm gonna take that off so I can redo it because I want this to be perfect. Perfect. Okay, so I have that. I'm just gonna wash this transfer and we're gonna do the bottom after we do the top. Hold on. All right, 
so we will just dry this transfer by putting it on the microfiber side of our fuzzing cloth. And then I'm just gonna close it up like a sandwich and let that dry for a minute. And then I'm going to dry our word Santa. So I didn't dry off my board after I wiped with that board eraser. So I had some moisture. You can see a little bit of bleed, just tiny, tiny bit. You wouldn't even be able to notice it. If it does bother you, you could always take your detail tool and just scrape off any extra. This is not really worth it because I think it looks great. But that's just, if you're wondering why that happens, is because you should really wipe your board off with like a paper towel to make sure it's dry after you use a board eraser. I did not. I am going to make sure that is dry and we'll get our other piece called Days Till. I'm surprised these have any stick at all because I made so many countdowns with this transfer last year. Um, let me show you guys my favorite. Where is my favorite? I made the most gorgeous countdown. Oh, I'm going to have to find it now that I talked about it, right? If you want to get an idea of what this transfer can do, let me show you guys. So I used our box frame to make this one. So it has that ornament that I showed you. It all comes on the same transfer, days until Christmas. And then I glued a chalk chip right in the middle. Did you see that I used glitter? <laughs> Isn't that glitter pretty? Isn't this cute? I was going to give this away for a Christmas present last year. And then I, I loved it. So I just kept it. Remember, it's, the surfaces are double-sided. Um, but there's a chalk chip on here. These are the numbers that come with the transfer. So you can re-chalk it every day. Um, and I just glued. So this is another project. So when you get these transfers, remember, you can do more than one project. It's not like it's just going to be for the Grinch. Okay. I had to show you guys that because it's so cute. All right, so then we're gonna put days until, and then let me get this fuzz off of there. I got a little piece of fuzz. I'm gonna use the spring zing here and use a new squeegee so that I don't get any red in it. I can't believe I'm even offering this color because I don't know what I'm gonna do when I run out. And honestly, I have not looked online to see if the spring zing is even still in the shop. All right, so we have days until. We could just leave it there, huh? But I like the stops here. All right, so I'm gonna continue to dry this transfer. Like this. But I think it's good when you guys see when I have little mess ups because I get so many messages sometimes about frustration. Like, oh, I messed it up. And I'm like, there's no crying and talking. Just erase it and do it again. Your transfer's reusable and it's gonna be okay. It doesn't, and you know what? I don't even want you to feel like you need to be perfection. I'm not perfection. And especially if you're making a gift, nobody expects perfection. But what I love about Chalk Couture is that you can design, love, and then repeat, right? So now we're just going to line this up. We're just gonna line this up and do that part that I messed up at the bottom. We'll just get the stops here, okay? I'm gonna grab some spring zing. And then we're going to go across just like this. This. Get 
all of that excess off so you can make much, 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 much more. Ta-da! Okay, so let's move all of this stuff off. My transfer was still wet. I didn't fully dry it. That's okay. All right, and then it's funny. Maybe I should take off my glasses. I felt like I'd be able to see with my glasses on, but obviously I, it doesn't matter. Um, so we use Scarlet and Spring Zing. Now, I'm trying to think of what ribbon you'll get. I kind of like this green, but I want it to go with a red. Let's try this. I, I don't know how to do ribbon. You guys know that. So there should be no expectations on your, on your part for me and ribbon. But I will send you <laughs> strands of ribbon. And I'm just going to double this. How is it? I think it goes right over left pull. Let's see. Well, that would work if I didn't want the snowflakes to show. Hold on. Maybe I should just do one. And this is what I got that mini bodabra for to try to learn this. Let's see. You know what? I think I should do back to back. That way both sides show something. Let's see. I like the other side because it has like gemstones. And I don't know if I've ever seen ribbon with gemstones. Okay, so one side will have gemstones, but I want the gemstones to be the most. Let's see. Let's go like this. No, we should do them both facing the same way. Go like this. Go like this. I'm gonna go like this. And then I'm going to go like this. You can tie any way you want. Let's see how this turns out. There we go. So at least in our tails we have, so I wanna see, see? Now I have the gemstones facing out. The only thing I don't have is this, but we have a glue gun, so we have a weapon. We have a weapon. I'm gonna make it tighter. We have a weapon to make ribbon go wherever we want, right? Like that. So this is a little big. I'm gonna make it a little smaller by pulling the tails. A little smaller, a little smaller. I'm gonna twist this so that the snowflakes show. I'm gonna twist this so that our bling shows, like that. And we have bling and snowflake here. Snowflake bling. And then once you fuss with this enough and get tired of fussing with it, you can cut your little tails. Let's see, cut. Cut. You can even cut the little tails at different lengths so that you can see them more. But I will give you um, several ribbons. I bought a lot of ribbon. You'll probably get like four pieces of ribbon of different variety. It'll all be assorted. There we go. I'm gonna cut this a little smaller and then glue it and then we can fuss with it after it's glued. So I'm just going to put a little piece of glue on the back of the ribbon and I'm gonna put it at the top. Oh, that turned out cuter than I thought it would with my non-ribbon skills. There we go. And then there you have it. Now you have a Christmas countdown. Does anybody know how many days it is until Christmas? Let's see. And then what you're gonna wanna do is take your chalk marker. I'm trying to see if I have other colors. Black, black, white. 
dun, 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 dun. we're gonna take our chalk marker um, and if you don't have any chalk markers you can use regular chalk um, but let's see how many days until Christmas let's just say it was 70 is it 60 something let's just say it was 60 I'll have to look it up. You can write on there. Um, I'm a little embarrassed. This one is not Chocotour, and you can see that it's not because it doesn't write very well. Hold on. I brought down my marker, and I don't remember what I did with it. Hold on. Hold on. Here it is. Here, now we can do a brand comparison. So do you see that 60 is very hard for you guys to see? Dun, 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 dun. Now I'm going to get out my chalk couture chalk marker. Um, they are a little more expensive <clears throat> than these off brands, but I'm going to show you why. Do you remember what I just showed you with that 60? Now watch with our chalk couture brand. Wow. Now this is a chalk marker. Look at that. So much different. Okay. So let's see. How cute is this? Does anybody know how many days? So look at this. You know what, it's so bright in here. I don't feel like you're getting the right color. So here you can actually see the green of the hand. You can see everything. You see the fluffy fur. Dun, 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 dun. Days until Santa. So this is one version, okay? The version on here is our 12 by 18. It's the same thing. You can notice that the arm is a little longer and then we use a different transfer. So Christy, to answer your question, let's go through here. I'm gonna show you guys um, how the workshop works then. You will get a bag. Now just watch the replay if you wanna see what comes in the bag. But you're gonna tell me that you want to sign up for the workshop and I'll have a bag prepared for you. But you're gonna wanna go to the chalk site and look at the surfaces. You may already have a surface, but you can just let me know what kind of surface you are using. Um, and then you're gonna have to go on the chalk site and order a transfer. Um, okay, so you may choose to do the countdown transfer we did here. You may choose to get the Santa, I can explain. Um, you may choose to get Merry Christmas. You can choose any transfer you want and then um, depending on what you want on your Grinch's fingers, you may wanna pick up our little trio so you can have it say better not pout. Um, no, the ho 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 is actually a retired transfer. That is just if you already have it. That was part of our Christmas minis from um, two years ago um, that was done on that picture. Um, but you can also freehand, you can write on the transfers, you can go through the Christmas transfers online. A lot of them have little sayings and little things that you can put on there. Um, we do have our Christmas minis also. So we have hundreds of transfers that you can use to put on your ornament, okay, like this. Um, but the no, the Santa I can explain, what did I do with it? <clears throat> Does not have the ho ho ho. It has son of a nutcracker, it has Santa I can explain, it has a bow and it has a bell, okay? It does not have that ho ho ho, unfortunately. Um, but I think if you were doing the Santa I can explain, I think this better not pout on that wooden ornament would be amazing, okay? So how it works is you will pick your surface. You'll let me know what surface you want. Um, you will order that from the chalk site. After you order your transfer from the chalk site, you will get your, um, your kit depending on the length of the arm you need on your surface, okay? And then on the date of the class, we will meet in the messenger room no, we'll meet in the Facebook group room. Um, and it's kind of like Zoom, but you don't need any extra apps. We meet there. I can see you, you can see me, um, and we'll all be able to talk to each other and create our masterpieces, okay? All right. <laughs> so if you have any questions, let me know. Um, I'll probably do at least one more um, project this week that uses the Grinch so you can see other ways to use it. You can order more than one bag if you want more pieces. Um, 
but make sure you go to the Chocoholic VIP site. Isn't this cute? I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, so let me go find out how many days until Christmas and then I'll post a picture picture of this Grinch arm. And uh, I hope you guys are all interested in the workshop. It's just a fun way. It is, what is it? The Sunday of Thanksgiving weekend because I feel like that is when you just want to kind of sit and have a little bit of me time. Um, if there's a lot of people that can't make that day, I am willing to make another date. But for now, that's the date that I have. Um, so yeah, let me know if you're interested and I will see you guys more this week. I finished my work week early so I can have more days to chalk. <laughs> All right, guys, have a great Sunday and I'll see you later. Bye.